In the following question, the question reads that if N2O4 gas is placed in a sealed vessel, the following equilibrium is established. So there's an equilibrium reaction given with N2O4 is getting converted into NO2 and NO2 is getting converted back into N2O4. So the rate of forward reaction equals the rate of backward reaction since it's at equilibrium. And it's also stated that the forward reaction is endo. So let's uh, write that down. The forward reaction is endothermic, which means that the reverse reaction would be exothermic. Now, and the question states, what happens when the temperature is increased? So if you, if you increase temperature, it's always the endothermic reaction, which is going to be favored. So endothermic reaction would relatively speed up is favored. And uh, in this case, it's the forward reaction. So forward reaction would speed up. Uh, there's going to be more forward reaction happening. Uh, so the options are uh, the equilibrium constant increases. The, uh, the equilibrium constant is the ratio of the products. So the equilibrium constant, let's say Kc, is the ratio of the concentration of products divided by the ratio of the concentration. So it's the ratio of the, of the products to reactant so if you're going to have more products if more forward reaction occurs because the endothermic reaction is being favored so more products are being formed and if the if the numerator increases in quantity then this would be larger it's going to give you a larger value would be obtained at higher temperature so so the first uh, option is correct the equilibrium constant is going to increase the ratio of products to reactants would be higher the second one is that the partial pressure of no2 increases so if, uh, if more gas uh, molecules are being produced, more forward reaction is happening. So the partial pressure of uh, NO2 would be higher because more molecules of NO2, you're going to have more molecules of NO2 and if you have more molecules of NO2, it's going to exert a larger pressure. So this second statement is also correct. Uh, the last one, the activation energy is unchanged, is also correct because the activation energy is only affected by adding a catalyst so that is going to remain unchanged it's going to remain exactly where it's only going to be affected by if you add a catalyst so all three statements are correct so according to the marking key this would be option a if all three statements are correct